Good morning, good afternoon, whenever you're watching this, happy Father's Day. I just want to take the time to say happy Father's Day to all the dads out there, all the fathers, all the grandfathers. Um, being a parent is the most responsibility that you could ever have, but it's the greatest gift that you could have. And if you've been blessed to be a parent and be a father, honor that and respect that until the millions of dads who honor, respect, and who take joy, whose inspiration and motivation for waking up every morning, for getting up to go out and go be great, or just be themselves, is being a parent and trying to be an inspiration or motivation for their children. If you're fortunate enough to have children who inspire and motivate you, like I do with, with my daughters, it's a blessing. So, hello to Boogie, a.k.a. Lauren, and Allie, Alexandria. Uh, the greatest gift that God has given me has been my daughters. And God, I thank you for the, the gift and the honor of being a dad to my daughters. So I want to salute all the dads out there, all the dads who, are, who, just, who do it every day. Who you don't see in the news, in the narrative, in the media, especially for dads of color, is always negative. But... I guarantee you, 90, probably 95, 98%, 99% of the dads out there are, are really doing, just doing the work. And they honor and they love being a dad, irregardless of what, a, what a, whatever and what other narrative or whatever narrative is out there. So I want to salute you dads, okay? On Father's Day, uh, happy Father's Day. Continue to, to be the great work. Uh, let me just leave you with one thing here. The first example of a man, for better or for worse, the first example of how a man should be and how a man should treat a woman 